Ah, ah, see, senorita. All right. Um, so in this example, guys, or at least let's go ahead and plot these first um, first count of three. So again, remember, like this polar coordinate system is just on the x-y axis. All right. But remember, we talked about our polar points are in terms of r and theta. And we came across that by like a point on the unit circle. We could also write as cosine and sine. And then depending on what the magnitude is or the radius, we would just multiply that radius. Um, and therefore, every x and y coordinate can be written as r cosine theta, r sine theta. Now, this is going to be very, very important to your understanding of these um, points. However, for the first problem, we don't really need to really worry about that. We can really just focus on the polar coordinate being r and theta, meaning that is my radius. So the first circle obviously has a radius of 1. So the second circle is a radius of 2. So it's going to be somewhere around here. And then we just need to graph where, where is, um, oh, I already did. That was supposed to be positive. Sorry about that. Um, where is positive 2 thirds? Oh, we can keep it negative. Well, let's just keep it positive. So what I like to do is just kind of go back to your memory of the unit circle. right? And let's just sketch the angle of where 2 thirds is. And just remember, guys, we always start here. Going in this, um, going counterclockwise is positive. If halfway around a circle, remember, is pi. So therefore, that's 3 pi over 3. right? You could write pi as 3 pi over 3. So that means we can just break that up into three parts. And therefore, 1 third, 2 thirds. So that angle is right there. So when you're sketching your coordinate point, you know, we're just going to have to estimate here. I mean, we're not going to be exactly perfect. But you could see like that coordinate point on the unit circle will be there. But since we have a radius of 2, we're going to go out here. And we'll label that as A. OK? So that is your first one. So hopefully, if you guys sketched A, um, if you would have sketched the negative one, the negative version would have been down there. right? But I changed it to a positive, so that's why I'd be up there. So if you want to leave the negative, that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. I just wanted to provide you guys